Hi, my name is Jason von Medding from the University of Newcastle, Australia. Um, I'm very pleased to be here at the IDRC conference. Um, and it's great that we are gathering global expertise from academia, government, non-government and private sector to discuss really, really relevant current issues that the world is facing regarding disaster reduction and climate change adaptation. Um, the last few days we've been considering emerging knowledge about technology, policy, practice um, that can help us create a more resilient and sustainable future um, for our planet. However, there's a couple of things that um, in particular that I'd like to um, point out that I don't feel have been considered to a great enough extent. Number one is um, gross global inequality, which is actually growing. And number two is whether there is a will to sacrifice in our society. So first of all, regarding inequality, um, we can see that the rich are becoming richer, the poor are being left further behind. So my question is, how can we address vulnerability to disasters um, without recognizing this fact? This inequality is actually allowed to exist and increase by unevenly geared financial systems and complicit government structures. Number two, does a will to sacrifice exist in humanity and where? To what degree will cultural pain be accepted for the future good of our um, humanity? Will public and private institutions actually accept and engage this short-term pain? So ultimately, we need to focus on global risk governance um, with the findings of our research. And we need to convince people not to vote for climate criminals and social thugs because who care little for future generations. So as we come together at the scientific conference, we all agree that DRR and CCA action is critical, but we also need to consider why, um, the why for change. Global leaders, institutions and corporations need to ask, will we act for humanity or will we only act for personal and group profit? Thank you.